I'm Nora, I attended Mama School for Girls and I study art, photography and media production. I chose to study A-level art at Hereford because I wanted to be around people who have a different set of skills and have variety of interests. Um, so not just purely art, I wanted to be around people who like science and other things as well. So I had a rounded sort of view of college and college experience. And I also chose to study here because it had a very good department. Like when I came to visit and look around, there was lots of things on, on show like work and I thought that the skill level was really good and I wanted to sort of make my skills better and sort of I was in awe of the work basically and wanted to sort of see where I could go with it here. Yeah. College differs from school because it's a lot more chill, a lot more chill and you are very self-led actually and you have to take your own initiative and sort of do your work. You have to find out what you're doing, be organised and get it done but you also have that freedom so once you get that balance you have a good sort of social life and work balance and you sort of see what it's actually like in the real world basically. What I like best about A-level art is the facilities that we have here. I've been able to sort of um, find a range of skills because we have so many different workshops that are available and we also have a very good department as a whole because everybody's excited to come in and all the teachers are very happy to do the work and everybody wants to be there so it has a good atmosphere. We also do lots of trips as well, that's, that's a really big thing. I've been on two big trips, we went to visit Farm University in London and they were overnight so that allowed me to sort of make so many new friends and also just feel comfortable with the art department and the people who are working there as well. Personally I've I started looking at portraiture a lot more and that was sort of the topic I went in because I could explore different visions of like identity and what it meant to me and how I portrayed myself as well in self-portraits and things like that. But I also enjoyed Sense of Place where we looked at sort of um, like places and what that meant to people and basically I've learned a lot about meaning behind the paintings and, and works and stuff and I think that was the main thing, not necessarily just a, a topic or a theme. The atmosphere at Hereford is a lot different to what I expected when I first came. It's very chill and it's very sort of self-led again. You've, you've got to take your own sort of, um, you've got to be ready for the day every, every day basically because it's always new, something new is happening. You're not doing that sort of school day where it's sort of nine until four and you, you've got to just work and work and work. You've got to basically find out what you want to do and then like make that work in your day and sort of go day by day as it comes. The advice I'd give to people looking to study art at Hereford is to be organised mainly. You have to plan out what you want to do and make sure you execute that plan straight away. Don't leave it. Organise, make lists, find out what works for you. I, I like mind mapping ideas and then writing them into lists and then I just get it done. As soon as you execute the idea you'll feel so much better and more organised and less stressed. So. Just get on it. <laughs> After college, I'm planning to go to university in UWE Bristol to study art. And then um, long term, I'm hoping to do sort of production design. So costume design, um, set design, hair and makeup design for TV and film. So I've always been interested in that. And I've sort of been able to work my artwork now into that sort of thing. So hopefully doing that in the future.